look you finally showed up. Yeah, I don't want to hear it. Dora and Clementine already roasted my soul. You deserved it. You should have stayed with Clementine during her pregnancy. Jesus Christ, you don't think I know that. I messed up. Alright, don't freaking rub it in. Good, because you're on Cody duty by yourself when Dora and I are away. And after 10 times, you can't have Clementine as help, dude. I can't care of a baby. You're gonna learn today. Jeez, fine. Can I at least get something to eat? There's Roman noodles in the cabinet. Make them yourself. Leo Leo Leo, I've heard a lot about you. I bet you have creepy girl. Now move aside. I want some noodles. The name's Gwen, you sack of dog crap. You left my girl Clementine out in the cold, and for the next year, I will make you go insane. Oh god. Good afternoon you peasants. We have some updates on the strawberry forest situation. An anonymous online petition is gaining rapid signatures by two strangers who claim to live there. Looks like we found your mother. Speak for yourself, that hairy chick looks like your twin. I'll knock you into the next show. I ain't scared of you boy. Anyways. We are holding an special event on Saturday. Our crews will be heading into Strawberry Forest to find who lives there, and more of their thoughts on the situations. Man this terrible. I always wanted to keep this place a secret. They might find us here. I understand, but some of them could actually help us. After this all boils over, we could finally be alone again. Well. I've always wanted to get away from these insane Titusville folks in this forest seemed secluded. There's been some stray people around here, but I don't want that crowd, not even for a moment. I know people are annoying, but this could help your house stand and prevent that mall from being here. It could backfire. For all we know, they could be some mall lovers that want to destroy our forest. Wait, your main gripe is the people, right? Well, yeah. I was thinking we can call the station to limit the amount of people allowed, and not record certain things. That's my baby. Let's get that station on the line. Alright Cody, I guess it's good night. What the heck was that? Bro, you gotta tell them girls to chill. Clementine just put a damn axe in my head. Holy crap dude. That's terrible. Take it out, then I'll treat the wound. I know you screwed up, but this is too far. Clementine, what the hell were you thinking? You could've killed Leo. Oh, so all of the sudden I'm supposed to care about the boy who didn't give a damn about me. I know by now Leo knows it was wrong to leave you. Now come on, don't chop him down while he's trying to make things right. After all, What's the point of getting him back if you're just gonna torture him? First off, that pun you just made was lame. Secondly, I'm not just gonna automatically forgive him for being a selfish coward. He's gonna feel the pain I felt. You and Dora already roasted the crap out of him. I'm more than sure he feels guilty and ashamed of what he did. Instead of seeking revenge, just move on and work on being parents together. You really don't understand, do you? And not to mention... You killed a dude for stepping on your shoes. All this and I revenge talk is bit hypocritical. I don't really like that anymore. And my actions don't excuse you slicing Leo. I know you're super pissed off at him, but this isn't gonna solve anything in the long run. Think about it. Yeah, alright dad. Damn, the news wore me out today. Not too tired for me, right? Of course not baby. Hey, I was wondering, could I be the dominant tonight? Well, I guess I'll see what you got today. Finally, I can't wait. My first order of business. Go get me some ice, bitch. Alright, Mr. Boris. Oh my god, you're the news lady. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm, her twin. Stop lying. But where's your clothes? Are you with somebody? No, no, that's not even your business. I'm just getting ice in the nude. Girl, don't make me laugh. Get out of my way, you annoying brat. No, you tell me what's going on, or you die. I'm always trapped, bitch.
Good evening everyone, I'm Sally, live in the controversial Strawberry Forest, to find who lives there. The owner sent an anonymous request to venture outdoors only, but I'm so curious that we're gonna go inside. Whoa, I specifically stated not to come in my house, I don't care. What's your name? Get the hell out, so, get the hell out. What do you normally do in this wonderful home? I said get out of my house, fine, jeez. Okay, we're going to school. Don't go crazy, and take very good care of Cody. Don't worry, I got him. I'll take care of you too. No you won't, I'm gone. Well, Leo, you were the only 100 on today's history test. Yes, that's great. But I heard what you did to Clementine, which knocks you down 50 points. What the hell? My conscience would haunt me if I gave a good grade to such a douche. You're grading my work, not my life. Iron and A. So give credit where it's due. I'm not rewarding a dude who ran from his pregnant girlfriend because he knows a few history questions. Dismiss yourself. Jeez, you think she's been too hard on Leo? No, that punk deserves all the hell he can get. But I'm sure he's trying to right his wrongs. Caillou, this isn't some easily forgivable stunt. He left Clementine worried, angry, and confused for months. That isn't something he could just fix with a sorry. He has to know exactly what he put her through. I'm not saying she shouldn't be upset, but Leo knows what he did, and in order for him to be a good father, Clementine should focus less on getting back and more on their child. She put Enix through his head for Christ's sakes. He didn't die, did he? Punk deserves all the crap he's getting. Hello everybody, and my partner was just exposed as a BDSM free. And you've been exposed as a fuckboy. Stop hating. In today's news, the owner of the home in Strawberry Forest was very secretive about her house. Titusville News wonders, what is she hiding? Drugs, artifacts. My co-anchor's balls. My co-anchor's dignity. Find out next week on our special, Strawberry Forest, the full picture.